Hey guys, this is Derek from Tech Connection. Uh, for this video, I'm going to go over how to fix a problem with the uh, Canon MP Navigator software when you run it on a brand new PC running a Windows 7 64-bit edition. Really, any edition, this, uh, this problem could happen. But let me show you the problem. So here on the desktop, I've got an icon for the uh, MP Navigator software, which Canon uses. And this software lets you do your scans, uh, organize your, your photos, things like that. Let me just show you what happens. I'm going to double click it. We're going to get this famous error here and nothing you do will fix that. So a lot of folks might come over here and they might uh, run as administrator, they might try the compatibility settings. Nothing will have any effect on this problem, uh, at least in those areas. So I wanted to show you guys how to fix this problem. So it's just something that we come across from time to time as we work with computers. And I thought I would share the solution. So in order to solve this, we're going to go to the Start menu, choose the Control Panel. I like to view my Control Panel by icon. And you're going to be looking for this one called Folder Options. Folder Options, when you bring it up, we're going to go to View. And we're going to tell it to show all the hidden files. Not too bad. And then I'll just minimize this for a second because we'll want to turn that back on afterwards. Now where I'm going, I'm going to go back to my start menu. And I'm going to click my username. And when I have the invisible items turned on, there's a bunch of extra things. But one in particular, app data. This is the one that I want. So in order to fix the problem, we're going to dig in this folder. So I'm going to double click it. We're after this one that's called roaming. So double click that. And for various uh, packages of software you've got installed, there will probably be a folder for each one. We're looking for the one that's uh, called Microsoft. And then once you've opened that, you want to scroll down a bit. And you're looking for the one that says Windows. So just to get a, uh, a view of how I got there, these are the folders. These are normally invisible. You cannot normally see them. And you can look for this one that says Network Shortcuts. OK, so whatever's in here, got to go. So let's go ahead and delete this item. You don't have to worry. It's not something serious that we all use. It's usually installed by some piece of software or some leftover junk. It's not important. We can close this now. And then I want to show you what happens when we double click on the software now. Oh, look at that. That's what we wanted to see. Maybe you've been looking for that for hours if you've experienced this problem. So now that we've solved our issue, the program will work normally. I'm going to restore my control panel, go back to folder options, and then I'm going to not show those items again. And then that'll hide those folders so that no one else uh, accidentally throws away a deleted system, you know, a secret file or something like that. They're usually hidden for a good reason. We don't want the thing to uh, accidentally be deleted in the future if we forget that we turn that on, so we turn it off. OK, so that's the solution. If you've got that problem with your Canon scanner, follow those steps. You should be good to go. If you find anything else wrong, maybe leave me a comment, something like that. Thanks for your time. Appreciate it, guys. Bye-bye.